Welcome to the product walk around video for the Brant S600 Scissor Neck Trailer. There's a number of features we've developed into this trailer to make it the best in its class. Paired with this S600 Scissor Neck Trailer, we have an L40 Live Roll Jeep. There's a few features on this Jeep that are going to make it more productive for you and your operators. The first being a pickup throat standard on the front of every Jeep, as well as fur decking right on the top to make it more slip resistant in adverse conditions. We've also developed this Jeep with a fully welded single plate form cross member frame that's going to make it less prone to cracking than many of our competitors bolted Jeep designs letting us set the bar for quality on this product. To make this live roll Jeep one of the easiest on the market to pull a scissor neck trailer onto, we have a low ramp angle with our own custom made live roll at the back that's superior to anything on the market because of our high end components and manufacturing capability. We've also included a dead roll part way up the deck to make sure that the winch line that's pulling the trailer up won't get caught on anything in between on the Jeep frame that you'd see on one of our competitors' models. We've designed this Jeep in a way that it's going to help you maximize a payload on the trailer behind it. One of the first ways is we've set out with a 49 inch axle spacing that's going to allow you to shift more load forward onto the Jeep and the truck tractor in front of it. We also offer standard 94 inch full length slide for the fifth wheel plate that's going to allow a greater range of positions and more trailers that can be attached to this and still haul road legal payload. To shorten the turnaround time when attaching or detaching from this Jeep, we offer standard two-speed landing gear legs that are going to accomplish that task faster than many competitors' offerings. To make this Jeep the most reliable on the market, We've offered a standard sealed enclosure for all the air controls to keep them out of the elements, as well as standard remote air tank line drains that are on the side of the frame rail, making them easy to get at for any operator, in turn making them more likely to perform that daily maintenance task. A couple of the other features offered on this L40 Jeep are air tank shutoffs and rebound chains, which double up as pinup chains in case you ever need to lift an axle because it becomes damaged during transport, if you want less axles on the ground when back hauling empty, or if you want to pin them up when you're loading the Jeep onto the trailer it's paired with for a backhaul. At the front of this S600 trailer, there's a few features that set it apart from the competitors. The first being our knife edge gooseneck profile that's going to be one of the least aggressive angles when you're loading equipment on. Keep the operator looking more downwards than upwards as he's driving equipment on. We also offer standard cable savers on the front of the pickup throat area so that your winch line can run underneath safely and not become damaged when winching the trailer onto the back of the Jeep or the truck. We've also designed it so that we can connect either to the left side, the right side, or down the center with the winch line. So if you're loading this trailer onto the back of your truck in uneven ground conditions, you can pick up one corner slightly faster than the other safely to make it match the angle that your truck's parked at and get you on the road faster. At the front of the trailer we also offer easy access greased rollers that are going to make this slide onto the back of the Jeep or the truck frame far easier. Those rollers are also designed so you can swap them out from the gooseneck extension back onto the main trailer quickly and easily. We also offer durable 2 inch apatong decking on the deck of the trailer and the scissor neck linkage so that it doesn't get gouged over time as you're hauling skidded loads onto the trailer. To make sure that the winch line doesn't get caught on any obstructions, we've made sure that there's a dead roll standard on every one of these trailers to make sure that it can glide as easily as possible over top of it when you're loading skidded shacks onto the back. This product's offered with an optional full width midship roll as well as optional kicker rolls that we've placed between the first and second axle of this trailer. The reason for doing that is it's going to make it a lot easier for loading double skid loads on because that positioning is going to let that second one roll off far easier without having a section of deck in between where it's going to get caught up on the wood and not want to slide as easily. Standard on this product is a lighted control box that's also sealed to keep all of the air controls inside away from the elements. 
We've also put all the switches inside possible to make sure that those are less prone to damage than on many of our competitors' units. We also offer standard first axle airlift that's inside this control box, so you can easily lift that axle if you don't need it for the job you're performing. To make it more likely for your operator to perform the daily maintenance task of draining the air tanks, we put remote air tank drain lines right on the side of the frame so that you can easily get at them and it's more likely to perform that daily maintenance task. We also offer multiple pin pocket positions for optimal shack placement when you're pulling loads onto the trailer, as well as chain pockets and three bar winches that are offset from driver side to passenger side to make sure that when you're strapping down pipe loads, you can make sure those don't shift off to one side because those three bar winches were all put on one side of the trailer, making our product way easier to operate than many others on the market. A couple of the other items we've designed into this trailer to make it longer lasting than any other trailer in this class is a set of 3 8 full length wheel covers that extend past the first axle of the trailer to make sure that it's less likely to become gouged over time from skidded loads getting dragged onto it. We also use our in-house machining capability to build a full length roll that is supported by two rollers underneath and is far less likely to become damaged over time from payload getting loaded up on top of it. This is a capability that nobody else in the industry offers in being able to source this component in-house, we're able to not compromise on quality. The C10 booster that's paired with this product offers a number of improvements on competitors' models in the market. Our cloth style booster has hooks at the bottom that are easily accessed from the side of the booster so that an operator doesn't need to reach underneath and into the middle and that's going to help especially when he's operating this in muddy or snowy conditions. We've also included a multiple position shim block that's going to optimize the suspension performance of this unit. This booster comes standard with a sealed control box at the back to house all the electrical and air connections. It comes standard with a regulated or common air control so that you can select between the two depending on the application you're using it in. We also offer an easy ride height indicator system at the back of the booster so an operator can quickly and easily see when it's within the proper operating range to be going down the road. At the front of this booster we offer a set of left hand and right hand dolly legs to make sure that you can quickly position it to match up with the trailer in front of it and get you down the road quicker. We also offer standard remote air tank drain lines on it that can be easily reached from the side of the frame rail to make sure that the operator doesn't have to climb underneath to reach that drain point and it makes it a quicker task for them. To increase the maneuverability that this product can offer, We've optimized the steer angle to reach 25 degrees as well as added shock absorbers to make it last longer by decreasing the vibration that this component's going to see. This booster is also going to have the ability to lock out that steer axle when traveling greater than 60 kilometers an hour to reduce booster steer and make sure that it is tracking directly behind your truck going down the road making your operator and everybody around this product safer. Make this product easier to operate than anyone else's on the market. We've also offered the ability to automatically dump the suspension and lock out the steer axle the minute that that operator puts the truck in reverse. That's going to keep him in the cab where he's safest and decrease the turnaround time when he needs to back up on the job site. Along with the shock absorbers that we've added to increase the service life of this booster, we've added heavy duty Torpress axle to it that's going to increase the high speed stability of this unit. Standard on this S600 trailer as well as their entire product line of heavy haul trailers is brake signal boost that's going to decrease the time it takes from when the operator hits the brakes in the truck to when the brakes on the trailer at the back react, which in turn is going to significantly reduce stopping distance and keep your operator safer when he's performing his daily tasks. We've also set the bar with our industry leading powder coat process for these trailers. This paint process starts with a sandblasted frame 
followed by a zinc base primer and then a urethane powder top coat that's going to make it far superior to anything on the market and keep this trailer looking like new down the road. Thank you for joining me on this product walk around video of our L40 Jeep, our C10 Booster and this S600 4 axle scissor neck trailer. For more information about any of these products, please contact your local Brat representative or visit brat.ca.